Now we haven't really had a summer in the UK this year, um, it's just been shit, I mean the UK is famous for having shit weather, but this year in particular, the summer's been crap, we had maybe three weeks of summer and the rest was just rain and misery and crap, but today it's supposed to be quite a nice day, sunny in the morning, get cloudy later, but clouds are better than rain, and I, I want to show you one of my favourite places in the world. I think, I mean, I've already, I've been doing this for a while now, you know, I've shown you around Bristol, but I've shown you around Bath, I don't like driving in Bath, it's, it's like, it's like getting a colonoscopy from Wolverine, but actually walking around the centre of Bath is lovely, and today I'm going to take you to Western Supermare, which is a seaside town, I believe it is the closest seaside town to Bristol, where I live, so I'm going to take you and show you about. Now I have so many childhood memories of coming here with my grandparents because they had a, a caravan that they would uh, come on holiday to just outside of Weston and they'd bring me and my brothers, well my big brother and you know it's just a blast. It was just childhood memories that you never really forget. Unfortunately my granddad is no longer with us, God rest his soul, but uh, I know my nan would be happy I'm going to Western Supermare, she loves it. Um, so yeah, there's also like a health thing, I need to start getting more exercise, which is why I started cycling, but um, because of a future video, wink, wink, my, my bike is currently at my fiance's house, so I'm just going to be walking up and down the seafront, and maybe getting a Mr. Whippy. I've, if there's a Mr. Whippy van, I, I have to. Um, I'll explain if I get one. We have sort of made it. We're in Weston, but I've stopped for breakfast. And when you're in Weston, there's only one place you want to stop for breakfast because it's the only only franchise they have around here. Oops. So I can't really speak about their coffee because to me, coffee is coffee, and I think. These people have spent thousands of pounds getting like the perfect coffee roast. I don't understand it, but their food and their donuts are so good and it's so much better than a cer certain restaurant behind me, which you can't see. The restaurant behind me has many names, but generally it's called the Golden Arches and their food is just overpriced garbage nowadays. Parking was fun, you know. <laughs> Absolute joke. What? 2023. You still can't just tap the card on the machine and pay for parking. Up. <laughs> Seem to have stumbled upon some sort of dirt bike race, which I had no idea about. But cool. We will try and get some shots of that. The water looks lovely though. must be the track and then the, the pits were behind me which is cool you can hear it going off in the distance and I had absolutely no idea it was happening um, but unfortunately the flow's got half the beach and they want money for me to actually go and film it or have a look at it, which is understandable, but I'm not that interested. I'm also on a budget because payday is next weekend, not this weekend. So I won't be able to film that, but usually, I swear you couldn't go on the, the go in the sea in Western. I think my dad had told me that, but as you can probably hear, I'm about to hit the winds, and I have absolutely no way of drying myself, but <laughs> I really want to get in the sea. And also, free Luca sale, thanks to the people under the mouth. Both me and my fiance love being by the sea. 
is like our favourite thing. And I just love listening to the waves and stuff. It's a shame she's not here. She didn't want to come out today. But it's just a shame. You can see that over there, I believe. I'm probably wrong. But that is me for it. You can see, and you've got the nice sailing boats. On the old Samsung phone, you had an option where if you were currently recording with the selfie camera, this one, you could tap and it would swap to the other camera, whereas the iPhone doesn't have that. So I'm having to film these in individual clips and put them all together, which is annoying, but <laughs> that is running out. Well, I can almost see it. Let's go and have a look. But I love the sailing boats. I think it's important in life to be a bit spontaneous. I mean, this was just a decision this morning. When I seen I couldn't go to the other place, I was like, right, where am I going? Let's go to Weston. Bosh, in the car, we're away. <laughs> and now I've seen dirt bikes and I've got a free drink. Well, I am definitely back making videos again for YouTube. And I'm not doing it because, well, before, you know, I, I quit because I got all caught up in the numbers and got fed up that nothing was happening um, and it sort of overclouded my judgment a bit and now I'm definitely making videos because I enjoy making videos. I enjoy vlogging and I enjoy you know coming out to these places. Like I said you need to be spontaneous in life and you have to just take the jump because you don't know what's going to happen anyway. Um, I would sit on the beach but I've got no way to wipe the sand off my bum. So I wouldn't be doing that, but as you can tell me, the beach, I can't turn the camera. You know, the beach goes on for quite a while. Uh, as for the bikes, it is all barricaded up. Uh, you can't see it, which is unfortunate, but once I've had enough of the beach, we're going to go look around some charity shops. And obviously I've got to find a western vinyl. I think every episode, if applicable, pardon me. <laughs> I will try and find a vinyl for wherever I am and it's very windy so you can't moan about my hair it's not my fault see so many jokes and memes on the internet about British food being crap but that that is proper grub especially on the beach look at the power boat power boat speed boats over there that's cool but anyhow I'll show you the record I found we have the bag I don't want the bag to fly away I was gonna walk in cool Geraine Geraine Jeremy, hang on, J Jermaine, his name is Jermaine, Jermaine Jackson. Precious moments with, it's got um, a duet with Whitney Houston, which is cool. Now I've never actually, I've never seen any of the other Jackson brothers at solo stuff. Maybe, I know she's not a brother, but Janet Jackson. So I thought for two pounds, Jermaine Jackson, I'll, I'll give it a go. Lovely day out, lovely visit to the beach. 
um, I would have filmed this last bit on the beach, but it was very busy and there's loads of people walking past and I don't, I mean, I, I said before, but I don't particularly want to be in the background of someone else's video. And I feel like other people might feel the same way. Anyway, it's a lovely place to visit. I mean, on a nice summer's day, this is now September. Um, I know what I said in the beginning, but it is September. It's a bit cooler, but you come here on a nice summer's day. Yeah, you can't, I don't, hmm. I'm confused because I've been told that you can't go in the sea, but as you could see, I clearly could, but there is quicksand. There's signs up to tell you danger quicksand. So I'm not going to advise going in the sea. You know, if you do go in the sea, you do it at your own leisure. <laughs> but it's just, if you're, it's nice for a day out, but I wouldn't come here on holiday. If you do come here on holiday, then I would definitely venture out and go to different places like Portershead. We've done a video on Portershead before. I'll probably do another one for this series maybe, but yeah, this has been favorite places and we have been to Western Supermare. <laughs>